lo que usted ya tiene, además de ser ideal para usarse con cualquier aplicación de mensajería instantánea o sistema de correo electrónico que usted ya está utilizando. Llámenos hoy al 832-384-9588 para ordenar su videotarjeta de negocios o envíenos un correo a videocar.naomedia.tv. Sabes que como te ven te tratan, llevas una vida llena de restricciones, quieres comer delicioso y sin culpas, la venganza es dulce, sobre todo si no te engorda. Hola, te habla Karen Surrutia de Clean Meal, me encanta comer delicioso y sobre todo sin culpas, sufres de diabetes, eres alérgico al gluten o intolerante a la lactosa, eres amante a los dulces, Clean Meal lleva a tu casa los postres más ricos y saludables que te puedas imaginar. Con los mejores ingredientes, libres de azúcar, de gluten y lactosa, orgánicos y 100% natural, que además están aprobados en la dieta keto. Llénate de energía, enamórate de ti y come sin culpas. Clean Meal, rico y saludable, porque te conviertes en lo que comes. Folks, good morning, good afternoon, or good evening, depending on where you are watching this show. Thank you for being here. My name is Rick Gutierrez. I'm the Managing Launch Director for BNI Global, and this is BNI Now, the one and only show dedicated to our BNI members to come on the show and talk about their business and tell us all about it, their great products and services. And we're excited to have a, uh, a great list of BNI members that are going to be here today. But you know, we have many new people that are uh, watching this show live right now, and they're probably wondering, what is this guy? talking about what is this BNI what are these initials BNI what do they stand for well I'll tell you a little bit about it BNI stands for Business Network International and it is the world's largest referral networking organization where we have now over 10,000 chapters around the world and after 36 years of existence we now have presence in over 70 countries and you know having presence around the world allows us to pass referrals from one member to another because the way that BNI works is very simple we only allow one member per profession per chapter, which means that there's no competition within your chapter. You're the only one that represents your industry. Now, talk about using your marketing dollars in a more creative, more effective way. I think it's pretty cool. So with that being said, 70 countries around the world, over 10,000 chapters, creeping up on 300,000 members around the world that generated $16.3 billion in thank you for close business. Now, thank you for close business means that this is the business that was generated via referrals that BNI members were able to pass from one to another. They pass referrals because one, you see them every week, so you know them, you like them and you trust them to take care of your clients and that's why you pass referrals to our BNI members. So they're able to close business and in 2020, through a pandemic, in a virtual setting, 16.3 billion dollars that was generated in thank you for close business that is huge that means um, employers keeping their doors open keeping employees working and you know being able to provide for their families and whatnot so it's a great organization and it's a great way to get here for more information we would like for you to visit our global website which is bni.com and uh, 
look up the uh, the tab that says find a meeting in your local area you will find a chapter and then you know subscribe and or register to visit that chapter any chapter in your area so that you can see what a meeting is all about if you happen to be here closer in the houston area in the houston texas area where this show is being aired live um, you can visit our regional website which is bnihouston.com there is a tab on there that says find a meeting after that there will be another tab that says chapter directory you can chat, uh, tap on that uh, chapter directory and then you will find the list of all of the chapters in the Houston area. Click on the chapter name, register to visit a chapter. All right, that's what BNI is, and we appreciate you guys tuning in and being here as we are here every single week promoting our members and their businesses. So with that being said, we have a great list of members that are going to be here talking about their business. So first up, I am extremely proud and happy to have uh, one of my launch directors that just came on board. It's a launch director not long ago. Uh, one of the top selling, uh, top producers in, in the real estate market. Miss Michelle Briggs, welcome to the show. Thank you, Rick. I appreciate being here and having the opportunity to share a little bit about me and my business. Well, we appreciate you taking the time because we know that uh, traveling and whatnot, getting here to the show. But you know what? Being able to have this show and being able to promote your business because it's an added benefit to your membership and here in BNI, it's a great thing, right? It, it really is. It, you know, not only do you have that visibility inside of your chapter and the opportunity to visit other chapters, you have this and the platform to really share who you are. Yeah, absolutely. So uh, we're going to give you an opportunity to, uh, this is the time, your time to shine, right? So this is what we're here for. So uh, imagine that you are in your chapter meeting on a weekly basis. We do uh, what we call a commercial where we get to introduce our business and ask for the business. So right now you've got a little bit more time. So give us a little bit more of an extended version of your uh, BNI commercial. Great. Well, good morning, everyone. My name is Michelle Briggs. I'm a residential realtor with Strata, Texas. We are throughout the metropolitan Houston area. And what makes me different is I have a collaborative approach when working with my sellers. I truly believe that you are, as the seller, you're the expert on your home and your house. You live there. You know mm -hmm. it. I'm the expert in the real estate market. So through our collaboration and through creating that marketing plan and the partnership, we can really create the stories and the plan that sells your home. Now, not only do I have a collaboration with my sellers, I do collaborate with buyers. Mm -hmm. And we want to know what their dreams are. We want to know what that home is. Home ownership matters. Yep. It, really, it really does. Absolutely. So you mentioned the word collaboration twice mm -hmm. there with your uh, sellers and your buyers. That is not something that I hear very often. You yeah. know, most people are just transactional, right? Mm -hmm. Most people just want to get the business done and close the business and go on about their business. But, you know, in BNI, we have one of one of our core values, a universal core value, but you can use it on a personal level and business level, um, building relationships. It is so important because buying or selling home at the end of the day is very emotional. Mm -hmm. And you have to have the, you have to have the trust. I mean, you really, you want to, I mean, it's like I always say, that it would be silly for me to think that you don't know a realtor mm -hmm. or anyone that's watching doesn't know one. Right. However, I invite them to sit down with me to really see what a collaborative partnership is. Mm -hmm. And it's taking both of our levels of expertise and creating what that is, the story, the home that they're dreaming of, the pool, you know, yep. the backyard kitchen, whatever that is. Mm -hmm. And you don't find that. Yeah. You don't find that. You know, one of the greatest stories uh, that we can get from our uh, our clients, especially in the real estate market, is it is an emotional, you know, uh, transaction. It is an emotional. Uh, it's the number, you know, one of the bigger investments that they're going to go through in, in their life, purchasing their home or selling their home. Um, but let's say for some folks that are um, looking to buy a home, they want to find that ideal home that has the ideal kitchen because you have to have the ideal kitchen with the ideal dining room because you're talking about many family meals <laughs> holidays in fact right so tell us a little bit about the collaboration that you go through to uh, build those relationships with your clients um what else can a client expect along with that collaboration my gosh so when we think about as a listing agent when we are the ones that are that have created the the partnership to list your home there are many facets to what to what you, you get mm -hmm. right not only is it professional pictures you get a video walkthrough on your home i personally provide one hour service from it's so cute because i love her day mm -hmm. smith she's a 
decorganizer. Right. And I provide that service, so that's nothing out of pocket for the sellers. I, and there's so many other things that, that I do provide. Again, we could this would take a while to go through it. But right. it's, it's primarily creating that plan of action. And with buyers, it is, again, sitting down with them and, mm -hmm. and what are they dreaming of? What are they wanting? What is their lifestyle? Mm -hmm. Are they joggers? Do they like to, you know, yeah. out to eat, playgrounds, things like that. Yeah. So at the end, I say that at the end of the day, look at me and the knowledge that they have mm -hmm. and truly the sincerity of who they are and honoring them, who they are in a transaction basically a professional that cares yeah yeah, yeah. It, it's huge right so that's along the side along the lines with the buyers but you know with uh, sellers right now I know that the market is uh, you know inventory is kind of low right uh, so it's uh, highly important that we also take care of our sellers as well right so um, tell us a little bit about your uh, let's go into something else real quick your BNI chapter yeah how fun has that been for you and your experience with be in that chapter. <laughs> I love my partners. Uh, we really, truly are family. It, we every single week we have an opportunity to listen for the best referral. Mm -hmm. How do we support their success within the chapter? Right. And it truly is a giver, giver's gain atmosphere, and it's fun. It's mm -hmm. seven thirty in the morning, Thursdays, Thursday mornings mm -hmm. every week. We have our one to ones, and you cannot help but want to be able to come that meeting the following week with a referral and a conversation of how they've taken care of a client that you referred to. And more importantly, a warm referral. Oh, yes. Very much so. <laughs> <laughs> right? Very all much right. so. All right, Michelle. So um, I want to give you an opportunity to invite all of our viewers to get a hold of you. How do we get a hold of you? Excellent. Well, thank you for the opportunity. Mm -hmm. So call me. <laughs> I, you know, in real estate, you really don't want to say call me. However, in this opportunity, definitely 713-256-5465. I do invite, um, I have a Facebook Live that I do every Tuesday, mm -hmm. the first, second, and third Tuesday of the month. And er, all of my social media is Realtor for You, R-E-L-T-R, the number four, and the letter U. That's pretty simple. Well, I want to thank so much for being on the show thank you for taking the time it was a blast having you thank, thank you for you. sharing with everyone um, an amazing realtor the top producing realtor that you are we hope to have you here back sometime soon because this was a lot of fun yeah I didn't get to touch on everything yeah I know we'll have more time <laughs> next time all right folks that's Michelle Briggs we'll be right back with our next guest thanks <laughs> what is so special about sleeping it boosts your mental health it's critical for your immune system weight management, and fertility, amongst other important aspects of your health. Most people do not know the average person spends a third of their life on a mattress. A hard reality is some people spend roughly seven years of their lives tossing and turning because their mattress needs replacing, or it's just a low quality mattress, which in turn leads to multiple spine issues and other health problems. Hi, I'm John McCarty with Mattress Having the exact mattress for you is critical for your overall well-being. And my goal is to help you find the exact mattress that will increase your quality of life and your loved ones and have a restful night's sleep. Call me at 832-815-8482. I'd love to help. We are back. Thank you for staying tuned in. That was Michelle Briggs that was here just a minute ago. And now we have our second guest on here. Well, our second and third guest because they're here together. And we're very excited because they are, uh, you know, powerhouses in their BNI chapters and in their industry as well. So I want to welcome uh, Vicky LeBeau and uh, Brian Altman. Welcome to the show, guys. Thanks. Thanks for having us. Yeah, my pleasure. Thank you for being here. Um, you can turn a little bit so we can all have a conversation. You can turn towards me so that way we, we, we can have a conversation. But anyways, um, thank you for being on the show. Thank you for being here. It's exciting times because this is part of your membership, right? You know, to showcase your business and tell us all about it. So imagine that you're in your BNI chapter and you're doing your 30 second, 60 second commercial, whatever it may be. But give us a little bit more of an extended version because our viewers would like to know a little bit more and you have a little bit more time. So who would like to go first? Vicki? Right. Ladies yeah. first, right? Yes, absolutely. <laughs> Well, my name is Vicki and I'm from Texas Last Diet Health and Wellness, located in the Woodlands, right off of Interstate 45. Mm -hmm. So when you're driving down the interstate, you see a big red hand that says psychic. I'm located right there. Okay. I help folks lose weight and feel better. 
But what my specialty is, is diabetes. If you're struggling with getting your sugars in, under control, I am your girl. Okay. So most of the time when people go to the doctor, the doctor says, oh, you're a diabetic, here you go, and gives you a piece of paper with your medicines on it. Oh, yeah. Now it's my job to teach you how to figure that out and handle it. Yeah. It's something to be said about a, uh, a physician giving you a little piece of paper that says, go get this medicine, and then something, some other side effects might happen or whatnot, right? But you guys... Uh, with Texas Last Diet, uh, you guys are helping so many people out there in the world. Is it more of a, on a natural, holistic approach, or how is that? How, is, how do you guys do that? Absolutely. It's all about the food. Mm -hmm. So if you can't get your foods under control, then you just really don't have anything control, under control. And right. how I know that is because that's what I did. Mm -hmm. I went to the gym. I worked out like a fiend. I still couldn't lose weight, and nobody could tell me why. The doctor just kept saying, you need to lose weight by <laughs> eating right and, or, or eating less and working out more and that just doesn't work so you have to figure out the meat the, the balance well it's what you know, we are what we eat right you know those type of things and so um yes. now i have an interesting question because i think both of you can answer and, and uh brian maybe you can answer this question um for some of us even though we are on a meal plan and we're trying to you know watch what we eat and sometimes it is a hard thing to do how does a client that you guys have, how do they stay engaged? How do they stay motivated to continue with the plan? Well, I think that Vicki has an incredible program when it comes to the food and the substance that they need to eat. What we do is we bridge their nutritional gaps. So unfortunately, you can't eat enough the right foods at the right times, right? Right. So what we do is we give them what they need when they need it mm -hmm. okay and we take into account family history lifestyle medications uh, things of that nature mm -hmm. it's individually customized for them so we complement each other really well mm -hmm. she gives them all the, the the food and everything else and she's partnered up with us so she can also add that personalized mm -hmm. um, scenarios to yeah to her program okay yep. because I know that when uh, when you're trying to personalize either a workout regimen and or a meal plan and whatnot, um, everyone's anatomy is different, right? Everybody's <laughs> body is different. We all react different. I mean, one program cannot work the same for another program, for Absolutely. another person, right? So um, what steps do you guys take to determine what works? First of all, we listen to them. Right. And, and find out what they need. If they have problems with sugars and things like that, then we, we balance their program around the sugars and try to reduce those so mm -hmm. they can become more healthy. Once they start feeling better by taking the right supplements, um, we're able to go ahead and get their minds more clear because technically when you're hopped up on sugar, mm -hmm. you're not thinking straight. And I don't care what anybody says, you go out and you have pizza, beer, and the next day you're not feeling good, right? Yeah, so, <laughs> so so after those days of pizza and beer or whatever, right. we're really trying to help you learn how feeling better feels great. And once you start feeling great, all the most of the time, you want to really kind of choose that over not feeling great most of the time. And right. that's kind of where I think a lot of people are, especially now today with this COVID stuff. Everybody's been eating for such a long time they've forgotten what feeling good feels like <laughs> right so uh, I need to teach them how to eat their vegetables again how to take good natural su supplements that's what we do at Texas last diet well that's that's a very um, it's, it's great to have a system in place that allow that educates us on the reasons why to stay motivated and engaged to stay with the plan right um, but there are uh, there are some folks to where you know they can't get away from pizza or, or the beer so um, is it okay in your plan and what you guys have seen is it okay for one of your clients for example to have uh, a cheat day or, or whatever it is or do you guys provide a meal that's considered a cheat day I'll, I'll teach you how to do that okay. super easy okay so I can teach you how to get past those cheat days and then also into the where you're feeling all good and healthy mm -hmm. and you can go out and have pizza and beer because right. if somebody told me Vicki you can't have pizza and beer ever again I'm not doing that program um, and there's, so there's yeah. no way I would tell you how to do that. I'm going to teach you how to make good, healthy choices to get you to that point. So I made eggplant on um, pizza, and it was delicious. Was it pizza? No. But it got me to the next time to when I can really have a good pizza again, right? Yeah, because a lot of times it's mainly just about satisfying that palate. Yes. Right? right. It's exactly. not necessarily what our brains or our actual bodies need, yes. right? So, but for a lot of people, man, that palate is important. Yes. I mean, I don't know about you guys, but let's say, for example, lots of people out there, and I'm not trying to knock anyone that <laughs> likes their meat, you know, either medium rare or rare, but I don't think our bodies were created to produce, to um, 
to you know make our bodies go through something like that to where we put meals in our bodies and the body doesn't know what to do with it right well what a lot, a lot of people forget is that when they're working out they think that they can go out and eat that donuts and cakes right. and candies and stuff like that but that's not the truth because that's big a big huge lie uh, what happens is that pizza and cake and candies and stuff like that still has to go in your body still mm -hmm. has to digest and no matter how hard you work out it's your body still has to deal with that mm -hmm. and it's still breaking you down and aging you I can teach you how to only do that once in a while you're gonna get so much more benefit from your workouts like crazy yeah they uh, always say you can't out train a bad diet right yeah. and that's so true but here's the thing, there's no perfect people out there. And yeah. we're all creatures of habit. Right. Right. And there's a reason why this food tastes so good and it's so palatable. They mm -hmm. spend a lot of money trying to get to that bliss level mm -hmm. where it tastes really good, but it's not too much, you know, where you still yeah. you still want to crave it, right? Yeah, absolutely. So that's kind of where we were at. We're trying to give healthier you know, alternatives. Yeah. Well, you guys are doing an amazing job. Thank you for doing what you do because it helps our, our you know, people around the world and people in your local areas uh, be healthier and stay out of the doctor's office, right? <laughs> yes, that's so, the goal. Be proactive and of react. <laughs> exactly, right? exactly. So uh, we've got a couple of minutes uh, left, so tell me about your chapter. My chapter is fantastic. Yeah. We're, we're called the Go Getters. We meet every Wednesday at seven. Oh, actually, seven forty-five. But eight o'clock is when it starts. Okay. So come at seven forty-five. So we tell jokes. Rebecca is our president. She's fantastic. Mm -hmm. She's always got some good motivational to keep us going. Uh, we really would love it if you came and visit. Okay. It, uh, all you have to do is contact me at Texas Last Diet. I can hook you up with how to get in and come visit. Okay. Wonderful. And Brian, tell me about your your chapter. Actually, yes. So I'm in the Spring Klein chapter on the okay. health and wellness chair there, and I've uh, been in about a year. I just re-signed for the next two years, okay. so I'm excited. Um, it's been a really great opportunity for me to get the word out to people, uh, to get them healthier. Um, come and see us on Thursday mornings mm -hmm. at 7.30. I know it's early, but you know, uh, at least you can have the rest of the day. But yeah. uh, Thursday mornings, uh, Spring Klein Chapter, and you can reach me at my, web my email address is just wellness.altman at gmail. Okay, wonderful. Thank you so much, you guys, for being here. Um, this is something that is uh, we created for you guys, for the members to come on board and talk about your business and get some uh, some local and uh, national, international exposure for your business. So thank you awesome. so much for coming on to the show. <laughs> we appreciate you guys, and we're hoping to see you guys sometime soon again. Awesome. Thanks. Thanks for having us. Appreciate it. Appreciate yeah. it. Thank you for being here. All right, folks, there you have it. We'll be right back. Stay tuned with our next guest. Okay, that was we'll fun. I'm here to take you to a new frontier, the final frontier. In fact, you and I are going where no one has gone before. I'm Glenn Henderson, entrepreneur, success coach, and musician, and I want to personally invite you to take this journey with me in the pages of my best-selling new book, All I Need to Know About Success I Learned from Star Trek. We'll travel aboard the USS Enterprise, along with Captain James T. Kirk, Spock, and the finest crew in Starfleet. And we'll learn together about success principles, like how to work with a team and accomplish your goals, when to fight for what you believe, and when not to, and what your business really is, no matter what you do for a living. Beam aboard with me. My mission is your success. And I'll see you on the bridge. Live long and prosper. Hey folks, we are back. Thank you for uh, staying tuned in. We are now back with our, uh, our next guest. I told you guys we would have an excellent uh, panel of BNI members here today to share their story, their business, their products and services. So I am extremely, extremely honored to have um, someone who gave me a really great idea and might have to do because of his name, but Mr. James Idea, welcome to the show, buddy. Thank you. I'm glad to be here today. It's an honor to have you. Um, this is where you get to shine. You get to tell our audience, you know, all about you, your business, your products, your services, um, and, and let our viewers know exactly what it is that you do uh, professionally. Definitely. So again, I'm James Idea. I'm the area director for Club Z Tutoring Services. 
And what we do is that we connect students with highly qualified instructors who are very passionate about education. So like what, we're, what really makes us special is that we send certified teachers who will actually go to the homes to help kids with different subject areas, mm -hmm. whether it's going to be with reading, with right. math, physics, chemistry. Mm -hmm. So whatever subject you can think of, we usually have a tutor who can help them with that. Okay, wonderful. So thank you for your commercial. So a lot of things happening there. So uh, first and foremost, congratulations on your business. I think thank you guys you. are doing an amazing thing because everybody could use a little help, right? And, and we can all use a, a little bit of help. Our kids, you know, that are in schools or maybe going off to college or whatnot need to go and pass a, an exam or whatnot to get right. those grades. But um, give me a little bit of, uh, of information in regards to the process that you guys go through to hiring those you know, high qualified teachers to go out and tutor. Definitely. Well, one of the things um, that I look for when it comes to a, an excellent Club Z tutor is, you know, they have experience uh, with children. And so all of our tutors, they have at least three to five years of experience when it comes to either being in the classroom or working one to one to, with kids. Okay. In addition to that, uh, what makes them really great is that they're true experts in the field that they tutor. Okay. So whether it's physics or chemistry or calculus, we always have a tutor who can help with that. So just to make sure that we're clear, could it also be, let's say, your gym teacher that also teaches science and math or they have to be specialized in one particular subject? No, they don't necessarily have to have a certification in the area. They need to have experience with it and they're okay. very confident in, in being able to deliver that instruction in that area. Okay. And are you guys providing uh, services, tutoring services um, online, virtually, or, you know, you mentioned in person a minute ago, right? But are you guys also providing them uh, virtually? Yeah. So one of, the, one of the great things about Club Z is that in addition to the in-home services, we're also really good at being able to give like online instruction as well. So whether it's going to be through Zoom or Microsoft Teams or any of your other like online platforms, we have method for being able to deliver that instruction okay wonderful and for those um, um those teachers that go out into um you know people's homes to tutor, tutor their their children um nowadays the world has changed a little bit right it a is. lot of people are a little iffy about you know letting people into their home or whatnot right. so to make sure that all of our audience you know uh, knows that you guys are taking the proper uh, measures safety measures and precautions right. you know um how are you guys uh um uh, instructing your teachers to uh, you know you guys take ppp you know uh, equipment you know to the homes or how are you how are you guys doing that yeah so one of the things we take very seriously is going to be the safety of the tutors but also the families um, that we visit so mm -hmm. always going to be like with the social distancing and with the masks but we follow like the cdc guidelines to ensure that like um, all parties are safe um, during the learning process yeah so that's something that a lot of people want to know right i mean they want to know yeah. if all of our um, us you know people that are in business and we're going into either other businesses mm -hmm. or people's homes are we following you know the cdc guidelines right. are we you know taking the proper you know measures to make sure that all of our equipment that we need to over at Club Z to teach, to tutor mm -hmm. our, our students, um, you know, are they all sanitized and things like that. So uh, I wanted to bring that out because sure. so our audience can see that mm -hmm. you guys are, you know, um, going above and beyond to make sure that you're Absolutely. following those, those guidelines. So um, tell me a little bit about, um, aside from, you know, Club Z and tutoring, I mean, there's tons of tutoring services out there, right? right? Um, there's got to be like either 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 in your business vision or mission there's got to mm -hmm. be something that sets you apart from everybody else what would that be yeah so one of the things that really definitely sets us apart is that the tutors that we use they're always trained by a highly uh, qualified teacher so for okay. me myself I'm a certified teacher and a certified instructor mm -hmm. so they're getting specific instruction in the different methodologies for how we can create like a quality service when it comes to educational instruction okay wonderful thank you so much for providing us some information on sure. your business and, and your services that is amazing thank you for what you do there of uh, you know kids out there that yeah, need some tutoring and uh, being able to provide those services that is amazing but uh, um, let's jump into a different subject now tell me about your BNI chapter yeah um, BNI uh, first colony it's a wonderful chapter and what I would say is that like they exemplify what it means um, when it comes to the givers gain philosophy right you know because we're always looking out for each other and that we serve as an extended sales force mm -hmm. you know for our team members so we're always looking for ways to grow each other's businesses and also the camaraderie that we have in our chapter is what really makes it stands out and it's a joy to, to be there every Wednesday yeah it's every 
Wednesday at what time? Yeah, so it's every Wednesday at 7 in the morning uh, through Zoom. And so uh, we talk about our businesses and like ways that we can refer um, to each other. Yeah, and, and uh, one of those key elements there is being able to ask for some business, right? Yeah, exactly. You know? So um, First Colony, I don't know if you know this or not, but First Colony, did you know that that's, uh, that was one of the first uh, chapters ever built? here in the city of Houston. I did not realize that actually, no. <laughs> yeah, I, I believe it's one of the top five or one of the top 10, uh, you know, uh, chapters that was built here in the city of Houston. Yeah. Amazing chapter. I've heard nothing but amazing things about them. So if uh, our viewers want or live around the area of, you know, First Colony, how can they get an invitation to, uh, to visit you? I mean, can you provide us with your contact information so that they can contact you about Club Z and some potential business there, and then also contact you to send them an invitation to visit your chapter? Yeah, so we encourage everyone to look at our website. So it's going to be at www.clubztutoring.com because um, it has like a, an abundance of resources and it has my contact information over there to where we can settle um, we can set up a one-to-one -one consultation to discuss the details of like a unique instructional plan uh, for their kids okay wonderful um, and I just want to ask you one more thing sure. in regards to your business that I kind of just kind of dawned on me yeah. does uh, Club Z provide um, your clients with um, either a one-time tutoring service or do you guys provide like a package they you know different packages different levles that they can, that you can yeah. provide so with club z tutoring um we're a month-to-month -month, um a service and okay. so like we can adjust it based on the unique needs of the student so which means that if they wanted to do something like maybe 10 hours to 12 hours of tutoring per month mm -hmm. we can do that okay. but the beauty of it too is that once we get to the next month if they want to adjust it they have that flexibility and that's something that parents really love about it yeah absolutely I mean I think it's something important to to point out because a lot of people don't know whether they're gonna get locked in into mm -hmm. like a, a quarterly contract or a monthly or, or you know a year -long yearly contract. A year long yes. contract or something like that so I wanted to ask you about that sure. um, all right so I want to thank you so much for being on the show thank you for providing us your information about the show uh, unless there's anything very quickly that you want to add in regards to your I business. just wanted to say that like I appreciate everything that BNI has done for me because it's helped me to just grow my business mm -hmm. but it's just like with the givers gain of philosophy it's been like such a, a huge part of my business and I look forward to continued collaboration yeah I mean I think the the BNI philosophy with the number one core value is givers gain which basically I've always asked this question is like right. who are we if we're not of service to others Exactly. Right. Yes. So thank you again for being on the show. We certainly do appreciate you. And we hope to see you again on the show so we can talk a little bit more about Club Z and what great things you guys are doing. All right. Thank you for having me. Likewise. Appreciate thank you for being here. All right, folks. There you have it. We have uh, one more guest is going to be coming on board here in just a minute. Stay tuned. We'll be right back. As a critical aspect of your operations, you need the right technology partner to provide you and your business the peace of mind of having reliable and efficient IT systems. In addition, with cyber threats, ransomware at all-time high, adequate, continuous and proactive data protection for your business is an absolute must. Hi, this is Roland Parker with Impress Computer Solutions. We are experts in tailored IT solutions and professional 24-7 IT support services. We proactively monitor, maintain, manage, and protect your IT and data assets. Additionally, we have the know-how and horsepower to do the correct procuring of any and all computer systems or software your company may need. Having the correct IT infrastructure and not being able to operate safely and correctly is very expensive and can eventually destroy growth. So take a decisive step and call me today for a complimentary consultation at 281-647-9977 for your unique IT needs. Hey folks, we are back. Thank you for staying tuned in. We're happy that you're here and uh, we're happy, excited, elated to have our next guest who happens to be a very good friend of mine and an ex-BNI chapter fellow chapter member over at the Heights of Professionalism. 
when we were uh, members there. Uh, it's an honor to uh, introduce Mr. Austin Tanet. Welcome to the show. Hey, Rick, it's good to be here. And thank you so much for elevating me to a good friend. I'm honored. <laughs> well, you and I have uh, seen each other around the BNI world for a couple of years, or maybe a few years. And Absolutely. Uh, we've actually uh, shared quite a few stories. And we were members of uh, the same chapter. That is correct. That's yes. for a little while. So um, that's the reason why we're good friends. Absolutely. And I think they miss us. Would you agree? Uh, I totally agree. <laughs> um, all right. But uh, Austin. This is, a, this is a show that we created, okay. you know, for all of the members, you know, to come on the show and talk about their business, get some exposure on live TV. So this right here is your time to shine, my friend. This is where you get to do an extended version of your weekly, you know, uh, chapter commercial. Wishes do come true, huh, Rick? <laughs> Wishes do come true. So uh, tell us all about you, your company, your services, products, everything. Good. So let's start with, with the company. So, so Rick, you, you talk to a lot of business owners throughout the course of a week and a month, that sort of thing. Mm -hmm. And remember when you ask them a question, you say, hey, how's the business going? Mm -hmm. And then they'll typically will give you a question like, everything would be better if I could just right. dot, dot, dot. And typically that dot, dot, dot is some form of either better financial results better teams, mm -hmm. maybe creating some options for their organization. Maybe they want to sell out. Maybe they want to shift their responsibility as it relates to the business. So I, I as a business coach, that's the chair I hold in my BNI chapter, I help them with that. Help them work through what the, the dot, dot, dot means so they right. can have a, a business that works for them as opposed to the other way around. Yeah, and your company name is uh, Focal Point Coaching? Point coaching and training concept started by Brian Tracy. That name resonates more with the baby boomers, right. but uh, he's uh, written about 80 books. Uh, probably one of the early guys to the space in regards to performance improvement, small business uh, development, that sort of thing. Yeah. So, Austin, what, what, why is it why is it important for a business owner, either a new business owner or a tenured business owner that's been in business for many years? Why is it important? for every business owner to have a business coach. So I'm going to quote the patron saint of coaching, okay. Bill Gates. Okay. <laughs> Not that long ago, Bill Gates said, everybody needs a coach. Mm -hmm. Everybody needs somebody to help them, hold them accountable, help them uh, look at problems, situations, opportunities from different angles. And uh, most importantly, somebody to challenge their thinking. Mm -hmm. And so if you think about our journey, whether it be as business owners, whether it be in our career, even in our relationships that we have, how, how cool would it be to have somebody that's to say, hey, have you heard, thought about this or have you thought about that? So um, I'm having some unbelievable success right now with a few folks that are, a couple folks are starting businesses. And then a couple of folks are sort of reshifting, changing gears, if you will. Mm -hmm. And the ability to just to ask them questions and just encourage them to think a little bit differently about the, the path or journey that's ahead of them. So really important. Yeah, it's, it's very important because, you know, we have tons of business owners out there in the world that are what we call solopreneurs. That's correct. That don't believe that they need a coach. They know it all, right? Yes. But... They may be struggling in some areas that um, <laughs> they may not be ready to admit to until they have a conversation with someone that makes them say, oh, yeah, about that. <laughs> this, that, that is so true because um, I'm not sure if you saw my, I know we're, we're linked in together, but mm -hmm. I just recently completed a series with uh, Mattress Mac. Okay. It was the Houston Community College Mattress Mac School of Selling. Okay. Six workshops. We had 2,400 people register. We had 1,200 attendees, co-led it with another colleague. And our final session was, what, it, what do you do once you know everything? <laughs> so, so, so to your point. And so the thing that was amazing was um, some of the comments that came back. So 70% of the people that attended were business owners who were looking to sharpen their skills. Mm -hmm. But as we saw some of the comments in the chat room and some of the feedback, it was clear that they didn't need to sharpen their skills in this particular area. They, need, they needed to develop some skills right. yeah, absolutely. in this area. And so that applies to obviously other aspects of their business as well. Yeah. I always say, and I like to, um, I'm sure you're familiar with Stephen Covey's, you know, uh, Seven Habits of Highly Effective Very People. Very familiar, absolutely. Um, habit number seven, sharpen the saw, right? Sharpen the saw, you absolutely. You have to continue to sharpen the saw. And it doesn't matter how well educated or how successful you are in business and yes if you're listening that's probably you you're very successful but we can always use someone to talk to 
I, I couldn't agree with them more. So I, I, uh, early on when I'm having conversations with uh, clients or potential clients, I, I love to share. I says, look, you know, despite my boyish, charming, young, good looks, <laughs> been out of college almost 40 years now, right? Okay. A lot of great corporate successes. But I still have lots to learn. Mm -hmm. I have two or three coaches inside my coaching organization that hold me accountable. And as importantly, they are my sounding boards because we all need that shoulder to back to your earlier point, shoulder or just somebody mm -hmm. to bounce ideas off, just to make sure we're thinking about things correctly or are there are other ways to look at things. So yeah, yes. you know, so all of that comes back to uh, a couple of BNI core values. One, lifelong learning. Absolutely. We have to be open to someone coming in and saying, hey, you're doing great, but I just wanted to point out some of these things that, you know, might be beneficial to you. And yes. then the other core value is that stands out is traditions plus innovations. If we're not open to those things, to lifelong learning, and you can still keep some of, we can still keep some of those traditions just because we are who we are. We love traditions, right? Correct, absolutely. But we have to be open to innovating the way we go about um, operating our businesses. Did you did you sit through my mattress mag school? <laughs> because those were exactly the things that we were covering, cover, covering particularly yeah. in that, that, that last session about, you know, what do you do once you know everything? Mm -hmm. you, you go back, start all over again, and you innovate. Yeah. Because, uh, our competition, technology, trends in the market, none of that's standing still. So if we're not moving forward, attempting to stay uh, up, to, up to speed, up to, up to, uh, with, with all that's going on, we're going to get left behind. Yeah, absolutely. So, I mean, we can always go back to the drawing board and, you know, innovate things. But sometimes it's not necessarily that we need to go back to the drawing board. Sometimes we can still continue to do business, but we just need to pivot in the direction that we were going and, right. and head into a different direction, right? Uh, you know, right. So it's, it, to your point, it doesn't always have to be huge uh, strategic changes. It can mm -hmm. be little small things, as we talked about in the sales course, mm -hmm. things like regularly following up with people that mm -hmm. you've met in the last 90 days, right? Oh, yeah, yeah. that is an opportunity for me also. So it, it can be things just as small as that. Yeah. But and this is the power of of a coach or somebody to hold you accountable and say, where are you on that? Mm -hmm. You know, you, every thirty days, you're sitting down, taking out your list of prospects and, and and working through that to make sure that you've kept the promise mm -hmm. that you've made to your audience, yeah. and that becomes part of our our personal brand as well. Okay, wonderful. Hey, uh, it's we can talk about business all day long. We could. I mean, we, we can could talk be. about education all day long. <laughs> that, that but. Too. Um, <laughs> Right now, I'd like for you to tell me and your audience uh, about your chapter, your BNI chapter. Yeah, so good. As you know, before we got started, we were talking a little bit about that. Ours mm -hmm. is one of the newer chapters. Mm -hmm. Chapters, Cypress referral firms, been in place about eighteen months now, okay. and I'm um, just having a good time. I, I joined them. I took a year off BNI after you and I were together. I took a right. year off, then I rejoined this firm uh, back uh, October of, uh, of last year, 2020, okay. and I'm uh, just having a great time. Uh, we're learning together. We're doing some great things together. Unfortunately, uh, all chapters impacted by COVID. But as we're starting to come out of it, we've got a couple of great sort of event planners that are putting together a number of great activities. So mm -hmm. happy hours and some breakfasts. So we'll have an opportunity, not weekly, mm -hmm. but every other week getting together and sort of uh, uh, collaborating with one another. Have a very strong real estate sort of uh, in informal power team that's just doing some really great things as well. Yeah, and, and you guys have a great chapter because I've heard nothing but great things about uh, the Cypress Referral Firm. You've had uh, a few friends over there that I know, uh, Julia Fuentes yes, and Julia, Rocky yes. Martinez. I'm, 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 I mean, I'm telling you, pi and pillars of the chapter. I'm telling you, and I'm a little. I, I'm, I'm not sure how I made it in, but uh, Rick, a, thanks for putting a good word in yeah, for me. No worries, but I'm a little surprised that Mr. Rocky Martinez, if you're listening, or Julia Fuentes, if you guys have not been on the show, I have. I have no idea why, but you guys oh need to God, come to the show. Gotta be kidding. They're missing out this great. They're opportunity? missing this great opportunity, so you need to tell them when you get back to your chapter. I'll be meeting. sure and do that. I'll be sure and do that. All right, Austin, it's a great pleasure to have you here. But before we go, okay. let's give our audience uh, some information of how they can get in touch with you, so that you can, uh, you know, prove help them you know propel to the next level in their business i'm, I'm happy to do that so my uh, phone, easiest way is phone number 281-814-3745 or if you um I've, i'm on all over linkedin so austin tenet t-e-n-e-t-t-e -T -T -E. there's two of us out there there's this really good looking young guy that happens to be my son <laughs> but uh, i do look a few years older than him yeah. so linkedin is a, is a great way and of course through the chapter if you just google a cypress referral firm and my name austin tenet i'll come up 
All right. Wonderful. Well, we appreciate you being here. Thank you for taking the time to come out here and take advantage of, you know, this, uh, this opportunity to showcase your business and your services and products. So it's a great opportunity to do so. Um, I'm really hoping that you sign up again to come back because I would really continue. Like I have some additional questions that I would love to talk to you about on the show so that all of our audience can, you know, uh, get a little more education uh, when it comes to business. So, uh, look forward to having you again sometime in the future. Okay, Rick, it was, it's been a pleasure. And as I tell my, I do a lot of public speaking, and I always tell my people, I've never met a microphone that I didn't like. So I'd be happy to come back. <laughs> All right, well, we appreciate you. All right, folks, there you have it, Mr. Austin Tanette, and uh, we'll be right back with our next guest. Hi, this is Amy Gerard, Realtor with the Jorgensen Group. Buying or selling a property is an important step that will impact your life and the life of your loved ones. Did you know that having an experienced realtor at your side ensures more money in your pocket when buying or selling a property? In fact, the National Association of Realtors found consumers who did real estate transactions without a realtor by their side left money on the table. When selling, I perform a thorough market analysis to arrive at a price and marketing plan tailored to your needs. We recommend and help coordinate renovations, include a staging consultation, high-end signage, and the sharpest professional photography. Our dedicated marketing department makes your property shine to bring you the best and highest offers quickly. For buyers, I am actively adding to my list of new construction and off-market properties. We are up to date on the market trends and the industry standards to advise you on a competitive offer to help you snag your dream home. If you want to buy or sell a property, call me for a no pressure consultation. I have the right team and strong know-how to navigate your transaction with ease. Hey folks, we are back. Thank you for staying tuned in. And we are here with uh, another guest, another BNI member that's going to showcase their their business here with us. And I'm um, hoping that I do not butcher the last name, but I'm going to give it my very best shot. And we have Mr. Chris Barcombe. That's correct. All right, I did. I get a cookie for that. Um, thank you for being here. Thank you for being on the show and welcome. Hey, thanks for having me. I'm really excited be here thanks so much it's an exciting time uh, i think this is your first time being here on the show yes and, sir uh congratulations for being here and being live on tv so nothing wrong with a that a lot right? of fun yeah so um this is where you get to shine we let our members you know come on to the show get some additional exposure it's not just your chapter meetings every yeah. week or your one-to-ones uh, but this is a live tv show where you get to shine this is where you get to do an extended version of your you know, be an eye commercial um, and tell our audience um, all about you, your business, your products, your yeah. services. So take it away. All right. Thanks so much. Well, I'm Chris. I am the owner of Five Star Painting of Katie and Five Star Painting of Sugarland. And we ba focus mainly on residential repainting and repairs. We also do some commercial stuff where we do some light tenant improvements mm -hmm. and um, basically uh, have a lot of fun mm -hmm. helping people sort of you know, envision what they want to put up mm -hmm. with regards to color and design and then delivering that service for them. So yeah, it's fun. <laughs> it's, a, it's a lot of fun. And, you know, just a little while ago, uh, while well, we were in a commercial break, you and I were talking, but you have a you have a different bra background. You I do. Can, you know, tell us a little bit about I that. do. So uh, I spent 21 years in the Navy. Um, I was a Navy pilot and uh, flew helicopters. Um, and quite frankly, it was one of those jobs that you would be flying around some days and you just have this huge grin on your face and going, I can't believe I'm getting paid to do this. To do right. This, yeah. So, you know, when you, when you think about, you know, Top Gun movies, stuff like that, mm -hmm. I mean, there, there's more to it than that. Obviously, right, right? Obviously, yeah. So, um, I was really fortunate to be engaged though in an, in a part of Naval aviation in which we helped a lot of people, you know, helicopters are big giant buses mm -hmm. basically. Um, so I've really been involved in some cool stuff from hurricane, you know, disaster relief uh, during Hurricane Katrina, right. um, Nicaragua. I mean, all over the world, we've done these really fun and, and great things, right? Mm -hmm. So I retired after 21 years, and um, I didn't know what I wanted to do. Mm -hmm. I'm like, oh, suddenly I have to grow up and you know, like be a normal <laughs> guy, right? You're not, you're not 
Right to fly anyway. Right, exactly. <laughs> so um, I did some consulting work in the oil and gas industry. You know, it's wonderful here in Houston for that. But I wasn't having the fun that I was right. that I was having. Right, and a great friend of mine um, who had flown with in the Navy, um, he was in business for himself, and he said, "Have you ever, you know, thought about being your own business owner and mm-hmm. operator?" I said, no, I don't even know what P&L stands for. I don't have that <laughs> capability, right? Yeah. So we, we, we sat down and we talked and we looked at it. And I've always been intrigued with and um, involved with um, remodeling. Okay. And I need, but I needed to do something that made it possible for me to transition from you know, being in the military to actually being able to operate a business and deliver those services at a high quality level. And so painting mm-hmm. became readily apparent after I started looking at different concepts. Okay. And so here I am, you know, almost seven years later. Seven years later. Wow. Mm-hmm. Congratulations. Thank you. And uh, needless to say, thank you for your service. Thank oh, you for I the amazing it. things you. that, you've, uh, you, that you've done. Uh, but yeah, it was one of the things that I was going to ask in regards to what you've learned in the Navy. How do you apply some of those uh, yeah. lifelong lessons into your business now with Five Star Painting? That's a great question. So, you know, everything in the military is built on processes mm-hmm. and policies, right? right? And a system of, of doing things. Because when things become challenging, we as humans, tend to default to our own human factors Mm -hmm. and then that leads to problems Mm -hmm. because you don't really know what the outcome of a human's efforts are going to be right so but if you can clearly define a way of doing things that has a measured outcome Mm -hmm. then your success goes high it right it's it's a more predictable way of doing business right so one of the things that we've i think done really well is we have created a system of literally from the moment we um you know connect with the client to the moment that we shake hands with them and we're walking out the door right. to ensure their happiness. Right. Mm-hmm. Um, it's sort of an odd thing to say, but um, clients aren't looking for a great paint job. Mm-hmm. They expect it, right? right? That's the outcome of your efforts, mm-hmm. but it's the steps, you know, a through Z right. that gets you to that point. And if you don't have a great system, then you're not going to deliver a great paint job. So having learned all of that in the military, right. it was pretty easy for us to develop these great systems so that not only is it usable by one person, it's usable by our entire team. Right. Right. So it's a scalable process. Mm-hmm. So I am a very big fan of policies and procedures right. and, you know, systems, because if we don't have those in place, then you really don't know what you're doing. Your employees do not know what they're right. doing and your clients do not know what you're doing. That's a great point. Right. <laughs> right. And really, ultimately, our clients are our focus. Right. Right. We want to be servant leaders to them. Mm-hmm. We want to deliver great service and we want to deliver an, a great outcome. Right. Yep. So by defining how we're going to interact with them, how we're going to communicate how we're going to deliver our service the products and vendors that we use it all gets rolled up into this wonderful experience for them it's an amazing experience to be able to have that background right. and be able to put it together i'm really lucky yeah because you know I've, I've met many many business owners out there in the world as you can imagine we talk to a lot of business owners and they just go and open up a uh, you know a storefront right. and they have no idea what what to do next? Well, I, in, in, and I and I commend them though for even being right. bold enough exactly. right, to go out there and do that. And that's why I really think I'm fortunate yeah. that I have this opportunity to learn yeah. how to to sort of do that because uh, I I will tell you this: there's still an enormous learning curve. Right, right. There's so much that I still am learning and that well, we're, we're all learning, working on right on a, on yeah, a daily absolutely. basis. And we have to be open to that. Yes, sir. Absolutely. <laughs> absolutely. And so, uh, tell me a little bit about Five Star Painting. Uh, I know that you've been you know yeah. in business for yourself for about seven yeah. years, but there uh, Five Star uh, Painting goes beyond that, right? Absolutely, absolutely. So uh, first and foremost, we're a nationwide brand. Okay. All right. We're um, headquartered in Waco, Texas, and we have this amazing team of people there that helps us develop our processes and creates our you know our, our image our brand etc mm-hmm. right we live by a pretty strict code of ethics mm-hmm. right and we have some really wonderful you know rules that we live by my favorite though is have fun in the process it's right. our very last process right and so um, Pfizer painting isn't just a brand then you know it's an it's an ethos it's mm-hmm. what we want to appear to our you know clients and to right. our community right and then that's the other part of five star painting is how do you contribute to your community right so one of the things we focus on is um, make a wish foundation so we love to be a part of, of their projects right and then five star painting in and of itself 
uh, when we're delivering services to people, we don't see ourselves as a painting company, but a solutions provider. Right. So oftentimes clients have, especially in the, the, the areas that we work in, they have older homes and they need some significant repairs or other work. So we are able to basically provide a consultative approach to them for the type of products that are gonna most benefit them for their budget and the type of work that we're getting done. So it's really more of an organic, holistic approach to solution providing in the remodeling space. And it's something huge that goes uh, with that is that the client feels like someone is listening to them. Yes. You know, it's not just about the transaction. You're actually listening no. to your clients. Yeah, I, I, th- and I tell you, I think that's the key is um, a lot of times clients have some perspective of what they want to achieve. And with the Internet, it's very easy to learn. Right. But they still don't understand, like we were talking about those steps A through Z. Mm-hmm. Right. So if you can come in and show them how their vision can be achieved using this process. Right. right it puts them at ease. Mm-hmm. So then we're off to the races, you know, pretty yeah. quickly. You yeah, know, absolutely. So, yeah. so you, a little while ago, you mentioned residential and commercial yes. uh, remodeling and painting. Yeah. Right. Um, what area, a town, or do you yeah. guys go everywhere? Or how no, we, 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 um, we like to stay focused in some specific areas because um, we understand the architecture and the type of vendors and the right. supplies that are available. So we basically work, um, you know, west of six, you know, okay. sort of that um, just on the fringe of, uh, you know, Harris County, West Houston, gotcha. into Katy, all the way out literally to Sealy, okay. up to Brookshire, you know, Patterson area. So mm-hmm. basically all of Katy down to Richmond and Rosenberg. Mm-hmm. And then we work all over Sugarland in Missouri City, right? Okay. So those are our areas of, of yeah. expertise. You got quite a bit of a, uh, a range there. You've we got, do. You know, you got a we big do. area to yes. cover. Yes, yes. All right, wonderful. So, what? Uh, tell me about your your staff. I yeah, mean, you guys are you know fully equipped with full staff. Absolutely, like? absolutely. So, um, we have a production manager, Joseph Bodine. He's been uh, in the construction world for his whole life. This guy's okay. phenomenal. Um, and Joseph actually started off with us as a carpenter, and okay. we recognized pretty quickly that Joseph had this sort of innate ability to connect with clients. And really, again, it's about customer service. So, the carpentry was expected, but mm-hmm. we recognized Joseph. Had this amazing ability just to connect, understand, and how to deal with clients, right, and talk with them. So we made him our production manager. Nice. And this is basically the general manager of, of operations, right? Nice. So he handles all of our scheduling. He is looking at crew completion rates, you know, what things we need to do to get jobs done. And then mm-hmm. he has this amazing background, you know, and experience that if we run into a challenge, he knows how to overcome it, right? And then we have three full-time estimators. So we have Lisa Jane Doucette, we have Lisa Watson, and Nisha Gobin. So Lisa Jane is a certified color consultant. Okay. So she brings this unbelievable skill set. Wow. Right. Okay. When, because what's the biggest challenge? Mm-hmm. What colors do I pick? Right. Right. Yeah. We're going to handle the painting part, but most people want to know what it's going to look yeah. like. And they're educated on what's trending. Absolutely. Right. So in LJ, man, she's beautiful about that. And then Lisa Watson, interior designer. Wow. So she can look at your furnishings. She can look at your floors, everything that you've got going on, and she can recommend you know paints for your lifestyle. And then Nisha is just this super enthusiastic, focused on you mm-hmm. estimator, where she's listening to your needs, mm-hmm. and she just she's a mom, and she's you know moms juggle a hundred yeah, yeah, things yeah, throughout sure. the day, right? So Nisha applies those amazing skills to be able to look at those challenges that a client is dealing with. And she puts them together, and she yeah. you know lays out a program for them. That's awesome. Well, yeah. c- congratulations on Thank your business you. Thank on you. Five Star Painting. It's an amazing. Um, I appreciate that. Uh, amazing business. Thank you. Um, now, tell me a little bit about your chapter. So, B and I chapter, Katie. So, these are truly some of the most amazing people that I have ever been around. Right, okay. and it's one of those things where you know you've you've heard the the, the term if you want to be a millionaire, hanging out with millionaires. Right, right. So, hang out with five millionaires, you'll become the sixth. Right, exactly. So hang out with 58 people that are amazing entrepreneurs, business owners, yeah. and you'll become as amazing as and, and successful as them, right? Absolutely. So that's the influence that these wonderful folks have on me. Yeah. Um, I struggle with networking mm-hmm. and relationship building. Like on the surface, I seem like this, you know, happy outgoing guy, man, it's my defense mechanism, right? Right. right? So being around people though, that are truly interested yeah. in your success, and they're the big part is they're givers. Mm-hmm. It opens you up 
to to want to be a part of that. Yeah. So love these guys. Christina Long, one of your chapter members. Yes. Uh, one of the things that she said when she joined BNI Katie was um, the first thing that that got her attention was that the first thing they asked her was like, "How can we help you?" Yeah. And that's what you know. That's BNI exactly members right. are all about. You know, helping each other. So Dave Barker is, um, was.